Hello, my lovelies, and welcome to week five of our sort of online holiday club here at Cary Baptist Church in Preston. I hope you have had a lovely week. I hope you've been catching up on some of the Paralympic Games. They are so amazing to watch. Those people are incredible. But we are here for our last and final prayer of our summer holiday club. I know it is sad, but it's okay. You can come back and watch these videos whenever you like. Today's craft, we do need some equipment. You're gonna need a piece of paper. You are gonna need a pen. And you are going to need some scissors. And what we are going to start off by doing is folding our piece of paper in half the long way. And then we are going to start folding our paper like a fan. So you're going to fold the end over one way. Then you're going to flip it over. And you're going to fold that fold the other way. So I now have a zigzag. And then you're going to flip it over. And you're going to fold that fold again and we're just going to do that all the way down the line so i've done it i'm going to flip it over and i'm going to fold it back on itself all the way down the line and fold and flip and fold and flip although my last bit isn't long enough to make a fold so what i'm going to do is i'm going to cut down this line and just cut that piece of paper off and that can be put to one side. Now, what we are going to do is you are going to draw the shape of a gingerbread man. So let me show you because his arms and his legs need to be touching the side. So if you don't quite understand what I mean, then it needs to look a bit like this. See his arms and his legs touch the sides because when we cut him out, we're going to leave that attached. So let me start cutting mine to show you. So I'm going to cut into my shape. But his arms and his legs I haven't touched at all. They're still the edges of the paper. So you're going to cut all of your paper dolly people out. So keep it folded and cut it all at once. If you're little and you're going to struggle because your hands aren't quite strong enough with the paper... Go and find yourself an adult. I'm sure they will help you. So you're going to cut around your dolly shape, your gingerbread man. Just like that. Nearly there. I'm nearly there with mine. If at any point I go too fast for you, pause this video and wait till you catch up. Do not worry. So I now have my men folded up and what we are going to do is we are going to open up and you will have two strips of people all holding hands. How cool are they? And actually these are really helpful because today we are going to pray for people all around the world. And there are lots and lots of different people who need Jesus' love around the world. And I want us today to think about them. Who do you know in your life? Who do you know in your friends and family? Who have you heard about in the news that might need some of Jesus' love? And what you're going to do is with your pen, you're going to write their names. Or you're going to get an adult to help you write their names onto the tummies or the heads of your paper dollies so you might want to pray for mummy because she's not been feeling very well so you could write mummy on one of yours grandma might have fallen over and she's got a bit of a sore hip now and you think jesus could take away that pain well you could write her name maybe you've learned about a specific paralympian this week because you've been really inspired by them and actually you want to thank god for their amazing life so you could write their name on maybe you're really nervous about meeting your new teacher so you could write their name on and ask that God makes them extra kind or maybe you've got the same teacher from last year and you want to pray for your friends that everybody comes back happy and healthy so you could write all their names on maybe you've listened to the news this week there has been some very sad news in the news this week there has been some horrible fighting in Afghanistan again and there are people all around the world still getting very, very sick from COVID. So maybe you want to write about a specific country. 
it's completely up to you. I'm going to give you a few seconds of quiet now to write those names down on your paper dolly, people. If you need a few more minutes, though, you could pause this video and you could join us back when you have written the names on. So I'll give you a couple of seconds of quiet to write some names down on your pieces of paper. Cracking job. Well done, everyone. So we're going to pray together. Now I'm going to have, at one point in my prayer, I'm going to go, Lord God, we want to pray for these people. And I want you on the top of your lungs to shout the names of the people you have written on your paper dollies. Okay, I think we can do that. I think you're very good at being noisy, you guys. So I think you'll be cracking at this prayer. Let's pray together. Almighty God, you are phenomenal. Your love will never end and we cannot describe how thankful we are for that, Lord God. You make us so happy. And Lord God, we want to pray for these people. So shout your names out now. Shout them really loud. Good job. You're doing a great job. Shout them loud. At the loudest voice you've got, God can hear. Great job. Well done, everyone. Lord God, those people need you. Lord God, we want to thank you for a start for those people. But Lord God, we want you to hold them in your arms and lift them up and make them feel such such happiness and such peace and calm inside their hearts. Lord God, if those people are ill, make them better. If there is war, make them feel safe. If they just feel sad and lonely lord god be with them but for every single one of them lord god we pray their health we pray that you look after them and we pray that you live in their hearts one day lord god may we be those people who take your good news to them especially if they need it right now lord god because you are amazing and your love can take away even the saddest and most horriblest of things in your son's precious name we pray amen